Taj Mahal is not all there is to see in Agra. 40 kilometers from Agra is the most perfectly preserved Mughal city of Fatipa Sikri. Built between 1570 and 1586 by Akbar on the site of the home of the priest who forecast that his wife would bear him a son. The city was abandoned after a few years because of problems with the water supply. the train into the desert state of Rajasthan. Our first stop was Jaipur, the pink city. The town is in a desert-like landscape, surrounded by barren hills. Jaipur is a very exotic place. Streets full of snake charmers, elephants, camels, beautiful women in brightly colored saris and adorn adorned with chunky silver jewelry. The Palace of the Winds, built in 1799, is actually little more than a facade. The five-story building looks out over the main street of the old city. Its pink sandstone windows are semi-octagonal in shape and delicately honeycombed. It was originally built to enable ladies of the royal household to watch the everyday life and processions of the city. The city palace is a blend of Rajasthani and Mughal architecture. The former Maharaja still lives in part of the palace. The ground and first floor house a museum which has an extensive collection of art, carpets, enamel ware and old weapons dating back to the 15th century. the observatory Jaipur. This was the brainchild of Jai Singh II and was built 1728 to 34. The size of the large sundial made readings accurate down to three seconds. The large circles are for reading altitude and azimuths. A dozen structures are for calculating celestial latitudes and longitudes. He also built observatories in Delhi and Varanasi. Amber Fort, 11 kilometers out of Jaipur, was the ancient capital of Jaipur state. The fortress palace was constructed from 1592 by Raja Man Singh. The fort is a superb example of Rajput architecture, stunningly situated on, on a hillside overlooking a lake which reflects its terraces and ramparts.